Okay, what we're going to look at today is the electrophilic addition. It's a mechanism for the reaction of ethene with bromine. Now, the double bond in an ethene molecule is electron rich because it contains four electrons. When a bromine molecule approaches that double bond, because it's very electron rich, it will repel the electrons in the covalent bond between the bromine molecules. This causes it to polarize with some of the electrons moving towards this part of the bromine, making it delta negative. So the polarized bromine approaches the electron rich double bond and the electrons from the double bond will be attracted towards the delta positive. So hence, it's an electrophilic approach of the bromine delta plus. This in turn causes this bond to break, shown clearly by this double-headed arrow. So what we form, one of the bromines has now attached to one of the carbons, but the other carbon is now a carbocation because it has a positive charge. This bromine, this one here, is now a lone pair and is available to attack the carbocation like so. The bond must start between the lone pair, the arrow must start between the lone pair, otherwise you will lose marks in an exam. You then show the formation of the final product, which is 1 to 2 dibromoethane. Marks in an exam is for getting the two arrows correct in your first diagram, for showing the positive carbocation being attacked by the lone pair, and for your finally your product as shown here.